is my costume. I'm Octane's legs. Is that like a personal attack or something? Hey everyone, Thor and Smash here, and today we're going to be talking about the Return of Town takeovers in Season 13 because we finally have a new one and it's going to be on Olympus, along with two different LTMs that are going to be returning for this season, one that I didn't actually think was going to be coming back, and we also got to give out 50 bucks today. All you got to do is like, comment, subscribe. You guys know the drill, but now let's talk about Season 13. So with Season 13 fully underway, we got the Storm Point map update, and unfortunately it wasn't as intensive as a lot of people thought. We really only got the Rock Lobster POI and the IMC Armory scattered throughout. And so I was really hoping that with the leaked town takeover for Bangalore, they would be putting that in the mid-season update for the event. And that way we would have even more stuff added to Stormpoint to make it feel fresh continually throughout the season. However, I've been told that this will not be coming this season at this point. I think it could very well be scrapped, which would be very unfortunate as it would have been the largest town takeover in the game. And it seemed to fit the theme of Bangalore and Newcastle being the focus of the season. But from what I've been told, there is going to be a lifeline town takeover and it is going to be coming in near the end of the season. There are some voice files that have been found for med station this is ashes right here med station here and along with that lifeline has four unique voice lines which seems to back up that there will be some kind of med center involved in our town takeover ezra actually put online an early version of the map update which has the lifeline town takeover however due to the large watermarks it's kind of hard for me to try to figure out where the town takeover is but that is the code name for it in the files right now but there is other good news because we actually have a couple of limited time modes to keep the season pretty spicy and one that is confirmed coming that I was told is armed and dangerous which is a the mode we've seen before where it's only shotguns and sniper rifles and this will be making a return in season 13. There are two more LTMs that are supposed to come this season one is going to be control which has a bunch of new features that the developers let us know but they're saving it also for the latter half of the season and so therefore there is one other LTM that we should be expecting. I personally think it will be the killing time LTM as that is also in the files and was updated for the season 13 patch but Ezra also let us know that there is the plan to bring Shadow Royale to return on Olympus. So it could actually be a situation of either Killing Time or Shadow Royale for the Lifeline event, or maybe even Shadow Royale just as his own thing. It'll be really interesting to see what Respawn does with this. It is also even possible that we see the gun game mode that is supposed to be taking place on Skulltown as an LTM this season, as developer Josh Medina did make some references to Skulltown returning in the near future. However, this free DM game mode variant, I think is something that won't see until season 14 at the earliest, with the other two versions being a 6v6 TDM mode, and then also the uplink slash griffball style game mode that we saw on the Titanfall 2 map. And Shrugtoll also found some interesting stuff in the files regarding the specters that we've recently seen on those IMC armories where they, now they've actually been coded for self-destructing versions of themselves and a loot table entry for munitions drop. And it's for a game mode that is very similar to the Broken Ghost PvE event which we saw in Season 5 where you would fight waves of prowlers or other types of enemies as you did a quest line to actually find Ash's head. It was actually really fun and I've been hoping they would bring something back like this for a while. I would also expect this for season 14, but as always, nothing is ever set in stone until the developers show us in game. But overall, it does look like they have some really cool stuff in the works, and I hope we do see it soon because season 13 is off to a pretty good start. All we need to do is make sure that we get good limited time modes, fun new map changes, really to keep the season alive and to avoid what we saw in season 9 and season 10. Let me know down below, guys, how you feel about Bangalore's Town Takeover not coming this season and instead getting the Lifeline Med Center on Olympus. I'm also going to be doing a $50 giveaway still in this video that I have to announce a winner for. And until next time, Legends, keep slaying in the Outlands, and I'll see you out there.